staying with news from India, the decks have been cleared for tackling the property market seen as a major conduit for black money and other untaxed income. In public, some netas have welcomed it. On the back of demonetization, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has signaled the next direction of his war against corruption. The property market and its patrons widely believed to be the beneficiaries of untaxed, undeclared income. आपको मालूम होगा हमारे देश में बेनामी संपत्ति का एक कानून 1988 1988 में बना था लेकिन कभी भी न उसके रूल्स नहीं बने उसको नोटिफाई नहीं किया ऐसे ही वो ठंडे बस्ते में पड़ा रहा हमने उसको निकाला है और बड़ा धारदार बेनामी संपत्ति का कानून हमने बनाया है सम एस्टिमेट से 30 परसेंट ऑफ ऑल प्रॉपर्टी ट्रांजेक्शन इन्वॉल्व ब्लैक मनी Politicians and businessmen are widely alleged to own a lot of land. Not only has it been a safe destination for their black money, price appreciation has made it highly profitable. They are now expected to come under pressure as the new Benami Transactions Act lays down tough penalties ranging from imprisonment to heavy fines. But in public, the netas have welcomed the act. Arthik sankat aur gulami ki aur desh ja raha hai. कहीं पेटीएम का बात होता है कभी कैशलेस की बात होता है कभी बेनामी की तो बेनामी तो अब निकालो बेनामी समूचा सारा संपत्ति का बेनामी निकालो जो कहा है एकदम निकालना चाहिए This will work because in case but actually some uh, procedures have to be put into place and uh, certain actions have to be taken under the act because the act there was a benami act earlier as well when nothing happened in all, all these years so what they have to do is in fact constitute all the authorities under the act start taking actions which i think from whatever i have heard from the government and from the prime minister himself so has the common man yes it is definitely going to affect uh, when demonetization didn't live any person on in this country without getting affected how is it not going to affect the common people who are holding the properties they would be scared they would be damn scared and the penalization now is 7 years of imprisonment plus 25% of fair market value at that time of the transaction which of course means a lot of money which is going to be confiscated since the percentage of taxpayers in india is relatively low a tough law against benami properties is the need of the hour to check corruption jessica taneja for Vion in New Delhi